how to make yourself creative. I often got asked this question. So in this video, I'm going to talk to you about right, how to make yourself creative. And specifically, I want to share with you uh, how to be creative right, with a couple tips. Right? So what are these few tips? Right, let me share with you one by one. Hi, my name is Dixon, and for, for those of you who are new here, right, I'm an author, speaker, and facilitator on creativity and leadership. And I'm also the author of this book, uh, Leadership for Future of Work, Nine Ways to Build Career Edge Over Robots with Human Creativity. And today I wanted to talk to you about right, how to make yourself creative. Now, before I talk about a couple tips, right, let me uh, show you this diagram on the whiteboard. So on this diagram on the whiteboard, right, what did you see? What is the one thing you see? I give it three seconds. What is the one thing you see? So for most people, what they are seeing is they are seeing the red dot. Right? What they are seeing is they see that there's a red dot here. Okay? But for most of the people, right, they did not manage to see, right, there's actually a blank space, right, within this frame, right? There's a lot of blank space, white space, right? But what they are focusing on is just on this, like, red dot, okay? So what does that mean to you, right? That means the tip number one is if you want to be creative, if you want to make yourself creative, right? Number one is you have to change the way, right? You do things to change the way you look at things, right? So tip number one is change the way you do things to change the way you see things, right? So what does that mean is uh, maybe you have certain habits, right? You have developed, right? let's say, every morning, right? You commute to office, right? By train, right? So that's what you do every day, right? Uh, so now is it possible, right? You do something else, right? Can you go to office by bike or by walking or by uh, driving or whatever, right? So can you do something different, right? Break your routine, break your habit. Uh, that is the point number one I want to share with you is like change the way you do things, right? Change the way you see things, right? So that is tip number one. How about tip number two, right? Tip number two is you have to believe that you are creative, right? You have to believe that you are creative. Um, because a lot of people think that, oh, I'm not creative, I'm not creative. The moment you say you're not creative, right, then you are in the dead end role, right? So if you want to make yourself creative, right, you need to embrace this mindset, yes, I'm creative. And what's the third tip, right? The third tip is, right, you need to make sure that, right, you are very comfortable, right, with new ideas, new concepts. So for example, right, if you're in the workplace, uh, your colleagues propose some new ideas, right? You need to uh, have a more open-mindedness, right? To say, oh, why not, right? Why not we take on this new idea? So you need to be more open to some new ideas. And that's the third tip, right? So to recap, right, what are the three tips? Uh, number one is you have to change the way you do things or change the way you see things. Number two is you need to uh, have this uh, mindset called, yes, I'm creative. And thirdly is, you have to be very open-minded to new ideas. So I hope this video sharing is something useful to you. And if you want to know more about creativity and leadership, right, feel free to comment below. I'm happy to uh, do up another video for you. And once again, this is Dixon. Embrace creativity and make yourself creative. Cheers.